That's so cool. Holy shit, it's not cool, it's not cool, it's not cool. Oh man, thank God for my ghoul friends. Holy shit, they're colossal hits. That's not very nice of you. Thank you so much for joining me this game edge. We are back in, of course, Dying Lands. So this is Seven Days Die mod. And this has been quite amazing. I spent the whole night doing this. I'm running out of everything. So I actually expected to get up early, but there's some new zombie I haven't seen before. She's in here somewhere. Uh, morning is about to break, and so I'm kind of... Actually, I don't want to open this up just yet. I want to see if I can see her again. She's inside the damn base on the bottom. I'm more worried because there's a lot of zombies in there. Uh, I did make some holes here to try to find out where she was. I think she might blow up this uh, car. I think she might blow up the car. Uh, it, it may just happen. Now, I also think there's a snake somewhere in here or something. I don't know how. There it is. The snake's attacking her. Oh, wow. The snake's attacking. What the hell are they doing? The snake's attacking the girl. She must be a ghoul. She's being attacked by. Oh, wow. Holy moly. Holy crap. The snake is taking out cold. It's moving on. It's going off for the second turn. It's smacking her up good. I want to see this. Badly, actually. There we go. That's it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That snake just took her to town. And then I think he's dead, too. I think the snake's dead and she's dead. That is good. They both killed each other the last hit. Looks like they have the same hit points. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, that's something you do not see every day in this game. That was a lot of fun. All right. Well, nope. The snake looks like he's back alive. He's vicious as hell. Holy moly. Did you see that extension? Come on. It's the worst hitbox ever. That's right in the middle of the damn snake, too. Okay, got him good. Did I kill him this time? I think I must have killed him this time. All right, well, that's good news. Yeah, the zombie down there is below. Of course, you got four more minutes in-game, and they will be out and stop running, unless they're feral, of course, and that'd be a big problem. Let's just go take a tour of what I just did here. Uh, I did make up a bunch of stuff. I also have a bunch of crates here. They're not all full, because it's a pretty rough night. Uh, I did want to go look through a grilled here, which gives you 16 fullness. And this one here gives you 10 fullness. Again, uh, this costs only one meat compared to this one costing two meats. That's the reason why I don't like to take it. I could get 20 out of this. Uh, maybe thirst is about the only thing you degrade down. Uh, wellness wise, both these doubling up pretty much just a tiny bit less. But at the end of the day, fulfilling my tummy, I'm going to take this. But anyway, so this is made. Let's eat this up. And uh, it'll help us out quite a bit, actually, because I need my health back up. I don't like wasting this stuff, but uh, I will keep one in my inventory. Just so I can actually eat up. We don't have any kind of smell issues. That is fine. And we're actually going to take one drink here. And move ourselves up a little higher, too. That is excellent. All right. Daylight is broken. I think daylight is broken. It's 4 o'clock. Do we hear the music? I don't know if I heard the music or not. It's been pretty crazy. I also put a whole bunch of stuff here. I also tried to log from this point to this point, And it doesn't work up high. So that is something I just found out. I tried to test out. I never had to log from the top. I, I didn't want to go back downstairs. Uh, but yeah, that was a thing. I have two shivs. I'm gonna wait until the shiv breaks off and it becomes a nothing. Uh, just because of value. This must have been a ghoul or something. She was well dressed though for a ghoul. She was well dressed. Alright, oh, was nothing in the sedan already. Okay, cool. This is actually just a car park area. Alright. Very nice. We're gonna have to go inside and uh, rectify what the hell's going on there. That's just unacceptable. Uh, they've been like this all night long. I'm telling you, all night long. Yeah, let's chop down this tree. We're going to try and get some bit of wood we can get. We're going to have to make some more, of course, wood frames, too. There's going to be some logging stuff to do. I've been busy, as you guys know, <laughs> trying to survive the night here. Um, and uh, the, other, the bottom was just a little bit too nuts for me. There's a whole bunch of them. And I had no lights on, except for when I turned the fire on to cook. And that cost me. That cost me. Uh, yeah, that was pretty pretty crazy. Uh, they had a lot of zombies around me. They all started walking away finally. So they do kind of get away from us. Now, the reason why I'm chopping down these trees is to actually see what's going on. And also, like I mentioned, wood frames. Wood frames! Uh, right here. 
Let's make all of these so we can have as many as we possibly can to survive. Uh, we'll hold this off. We still have our water and all that. We can go and get some more. Let me chop these babies down and then we'll go inside and kill all the zombies unless they come at us. So we'll be right back. All right, so I went out to get some water and stuff and I found another well, actually. I went, I think I went the wrong way. Uh, but yeah, it's okay. It's all good. We actually found another well. I found some other things too on our way here. Nothing great actually to call home for. I did find one pill, which is good. So we'll keep that in case we ever get stuck. I don't have any first aid badges, as you can see. I had to craft up just regular badges to make sure shit don't walk on top of them. Uh, it's sure we don't have burn. Uh, sorry, we don't bleed to death. So that is something. Oh shit, that snake is for real. Now he did decrease the, the amount of snakes too at one point. He told me. And so, well, didn't tell me. Sorry, he wrote inside one of his uh, one of his updates. I think he decreased the amount. Damn it! Did I grab the other snake? I did grab the other snake there. Damn, this makes it a lot harder with these damn snakes. Because I, I, you're so wobbly. I'm looking on the other side too. I hit right that middle part, and it's a pain in the ass. Oh shit! Did you see that shit? Did you see that shit? He almost got me. Got him. We're in the head for you. There we go, sir. Now you're not you're not attacking. Okay. There we go. While you wait to become a core block, I'm gonna come and take you apart to pieces. Another crispy cream coming. All right, crispy cream zombie number two. I'm on fire. I don't think they're giving me anything, really, to tell you the truth, except for bringing up my nice skills. I don't think I've ever seen them give me... Oh, there we go, nails! Alright, let's use a little bit of a club action. Ouch. Ow. You saw last episode when the other zombies were catching on fire, they are touching him. Kind of tells you how, uh, how dangerous it is to get close and personal with this guy, actually. <laughs> yeah, I think I'd learn. No. No, I didn't. Let's cut you up in pieces. I'll take everything I can out of this area now. I just came here for just a little bit more water. So what I want to do is cook the water up before I head back inside the actual building. Uh, we'll just take apart everything here. I'm pretty sure the water... Uh, oh, the zombies can actually break through this wall very fast. And uh, yeah, This is not a bunker. Any way you're short, this is actually just a well from what I've seen. Unless there's something hidden underneath there I don't know about. Uh, we'll see. We'll, we'll, I'm sure we'll have that time to actually check that out. Uh, but for now, we're just going to avoid them going into it. Seems to be a big pain in the ass last time. So I'm just going to remove this. And we'll head back to the base right away. I think I need a better axe. Damn it. I need better quality stuff. That's what I need. Let's just take this apart and I'll meet you guys back at the base. Okay, so the well is just about west of us here, which is really nice. That makes a big difference. There is zombies inside this building, which we've dealt with, but I know that's a big problem. Uh, but I'm going to first just make sure I have my water going at full throttle. Uh, we're just going to check out to see how long this is going to take to get this done for murky water itself. Uh, let's see your recipes. Bottle water, and we're going to see how long that takes. Total is 1 minute and 10 seconds. Let's just make sure we have that. Sure, 120. We're also going to drop this. Oops. 120. Perfect, and we'll start you up, and we'll actually start cooking. So we'll have that water going while we're doing this. We actually put in all that stuff here, too, if you want to, and it can cook up more food. But we have tons here. Tons to go around, which is uh, really nice. God, our coffers are empty. Our coffers are empty, I tell you. Uh, let's actually do recipes here. We're going to do more arrows. No choice. And, uh, yeah, I think we're okay. We'll drop off all the rest of this goodness here. And uh, I am going to get more scrap again because I need it. We don't have a forge out yet, so that is not a problem. We have a wood, a little bit of stone, which I was able to collect. And, of course, some, some pharmaceuticals here, which is very important for us to get done. I'm trying to know where I put my pharma. I think I put it here. <laughs> I don't have anything. I'll put two here. I'm sure I'll find them. Well, I'll put one here for now. I'm actually that worried about that being a problem. And we'll place that here. We'll grab the water we can. Only have 21, 20 seconds left. Yeah, let's just finish up here. We'll get that. And also have all these in, in the coffers here too. So I'm placing everything in somewhat of an order. So that way when we do have uh, stuff. I might actually keep this as a base. I don't know. I don't know. One way or another. In case. I'm just going to keep things in order. It makes my life a lot easier. I can make more bacon and eggs afterwards. Very, very sweet. Awesome. All right. We're going to keep the extra meat we have here on us. 
because uh, we do get hungry. It doesn't seem to be the cans being anywhere good for us, so I'm going to leave that be. And there we go. Our fire is out. We're not wasting anything. Let's go and kill these zombies in here. That have been such an annoyance. And yeah, we, we should be okay. Didn't have any more vultures overnight, which is really nice. I was kind of scared. I thought it'd be more of them. That's why I started building up walls. Just to put a ceiling, and I realized we ran out of wood. I was like, damn it. So yeah, that was a thing too. That was a thing. All right. So if you're asking why you're planting them all here, it's not good for hordes. I do know, uh, but for now we don't have a horde night. So I'm gonna use these to actually harvest at night. If I need to, I can hop back down here and do it. And we can also clean up all these stuff here if you want to. Best way, pretty much, to do is to crouch and get out there and punch this. And grab as much as you can. Everything really makes a difference. It needs for bows and many other things, so why not? Let's just do it and go through the front door and take care of these, you know, bums that are inside here. Causing me so much pain at night. Oh, God. Hope they don't respawn every single night. I mean, holy crap. If that is a thing for this mod, I'm gonna cry. I'm sure they destroyed a lot of stuff. It's a laundromat. What the freak? Oh, it was next to us. Okay. I thought I, moved. I thought it was on top of the actual other place, but oh, I sure do want to break it. I didn't want to break the stuff inside, so larger mats, okay. Could be actually a, quite a helpful place to go. Help us bring up our, our uh, scavenging. We'll do the row here all the way down, and we'll go and kill him. He's stuck in a bathroom or something. I left the door open. I know there could be people coming from behind us. The thing I'm not worried about is that I'm actually... Uh, don't want it to be a problem with my side, too. I won't be able to run it. I want to be able to run my ass out if I have to. Actually, we're reducing quite a bit the... Uh, I've made a fiber hat before. And you'll see it here. Look, minus 10. This is minus 10, too. Obviously, the fiber hat is in better quality because I've actually have it repaired and stuff. So, yeah, that's going to be... Yeah, it's not great. So, we'll, we'll just... I like the black hat, though. Ugh, whatever. It's all good. Um, right here, we actually will have to get some stuff to be able to fix this, too. Here, cloth. Uh, repair. We can actually start wearing some of this. But minus 10 right now is going to put me in a really cold, cold weather. I'm not in the mood for that right now. It depends on how the weather is. And this one seems to change quite a bit. Um, he got quiet, so I'm not really, I'm not really worried about him now. Since he's so freaking quiet. Might as well take advantage of this. We'll have time to kill him. We'll go through all the washers here. And again, the scavenging is going to go up by this time we get to, like, I think the next couple here. We should have scavenging skills go up. This will help us quite a bit. Like I mentioned, bam, bam, bam. Do this row and go kill him. Don't finish up the last few rows. So many of them. It's unbelievable. Cloth, cloth, all helpful stuff. All right. And also, um, overnight, as you can see, well, I made a hat. I told you I made a fiber hat. What's this? Is just trash, just trash. Oh, someone passed away. What the hell happened? Oh, it must have been attacked from another animal. Maybe a ghoul? That's very possible. Or maybe that is a ghoul. I don't know. I don't know. A wrench, nice. Oh, it's gonna take forever. I do really want to hit that. There we go, scavenging is now up to six. Got a long way to go to move it up to quality much higher. But, I tell you now, I hit these laundry mats like crazy for this one reason. And uh, yeah, it's it's well worthwhile. Hit them up, hit them up. Just a cloth alone and the clothes that you're gonna pick up. They might not be all fantastic, but hell yeah, look at that. You can go through that afterwards if you want to. I got the, I got a hat at 127 now. This is much better. Let's repair that. And wear it. Still going to be minus 7, but it's going to be a lot better than this crap. Uh, these shorts and stuff like this. Durability is 44. It's 44. I'm not going to wear a skirt. That is for sure. We are trader is no longer in our town. He is gone. So we're not going to have anything. That's minus 5, though. So I don't know. We could actually wear that. Repair. Are these better than the ones I have? These are going to be questioned. Should I actually check that out before? No, the other ones are 107. Plus four. Oh, well, it is what it is. We'll scrap them and we'll get what we can. Uh, here, we'll wear these. We can't repair these, so we need forged iron. Uh, these pretty much just give you a little bit more puncture radiation and stuff, so it's not a big deal. We'll scrap you. And, of course, a sweater could be handy, actually. Sometimes. We'll see what the kind of quality we get out of the other stuff. This is actually 
not bad too especially when it gets cold right now we're starting to get warm as heck just checking make sure there's nothing on top we got everything on these two sides here and the only thing left is pretty much this side plus some chairs and that zombie pretty much got either killed himself uh, by hitting up something electrocuting himself with the machine which i heard him hit a couple times overnight so he kept on hitting that machine down here the vending machine and electrocuting himself which was kind of funny actually i, I kind of tell you I, I kind of enjoyed it hearing him fry a little bit <laughs> kind of changes up things all right our main goal today we have to go and search out some more loot and get ourselves going kill as many zombies as we can find as much as we can again uh, zombies don't give out as much loot as we can actually get this man has a lot of cloth not much other things damn it there we go all oh, scavenging is up hey um but yeah uh, we're gonna have to go in the, inside the pois which is actually the buildings themselves and that'll be very important oh he was hitting up the fridge too there might have been another fridge there yeah he's still in there he killed his friend here look I can see it. Look over. Look. See it? He's trying to hop over. What's, it's George. 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 Are you a bathroom lieutenant now? Or he just got stuck in the lock? Oh, were you doing what I think you're doing? Were you doing some bad drugs? Oh, well. The, uh, well, there's not much security between these two. They must have broken this off. Nothing in the toilet. Nothing in that toilet. Yeah, we got some pipes there for free once to use a wrench. Awesome. All right, this is pretty good. There's a back way to this, too. Holy, where did you guys all come from? Is that a football player? Holy moly. Yeah, I'm going to start using arrows, you little son of bitches. It's two on one, one runs two. Damn it. No one else is spawning in here. He's down. Oh, he's tricking me, a little son of a bitch. Look, I don't know where I'm going. He's got to come around that corner. Bam. Ooh, that came close. Another one in the neck. Another one in the head. Hoo Tell me you have something good on you. Not a dirty t-shirt. Got some fat on you. And some bones. Oh. <laughs> I'm not even going there. <laughs> Alright. Got a whole bunch of bones there too. That's awesome. And we're going to drop everything upstairs really quick. Actually, I could do just a drop off crate right here. I got nothing to go up there for and maybe make it easier than having to go up and down every two seconds. Let's craft that up. I know it takes a little bit of time now, but later on it won't be so bad. Let's grab you, and bam. All right. Perfect. Football helmet. I, I think I might keep the wrench anyways. Uh, we can actually take a little snack. It's only brought me up that much. How much is there? Ten for each? Screw it, I'm gonna bring myself up higher. Let's try and get the healing as much as I possibly can. And we're gonna drink and make sure we get back. So of course this brings down thirst every single time. That is perfect. And we'll actually get these too. Perfect. Oh, it's too much stuff to carry. Cloth and fat. Alright, that's good. Bam, 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 bam. Everything else is good. We got our weapons. We have everything else we need. We could make another shiv if we don't have enough. So I'm gonna take that with me too. Okay. Always keep the quality as high as we possibly can. We have a lots to do, lots to get today. Let's grab as much as loot as we possibly can here at two. Also make ourselves another axe. I wish our levels did our levels go up? I actually heard did it go up? Eight? No, weapon smithing is not up. Neither is, of course. That means tool smithing. That sucks. Let's see, we will hold off until we have to build the axe itself. Because uh, I don't want to waste too much. We'll take apart these things very easy to hit. Of course, you get one at a time. Uh, maybe a little more than that. I'm not too sure exact. But yeah, we get some of it. Oh, four. Wow. Actually, it makes it extremely worthwhile. Uh, now, the big trees themselves. I'm not sure if these ones will give us feathers. But the other trees will give feathers now. That's part of the new update that he came out with. Which is really, really cool. I do like that idea. It did help out quite a bit. This one did not do anything. Uh, but we'll keep this here for now. We'll, uh, re we'll replenish it. 
Alright, we're going to hit up house upon house. And uh, there's ferals inside it, so bury cells. That's a branch. I thought something was sticking through. Bear. Why is he pissed off there? The laughing is different too. It's never something I just never noticed it. Maybe it's oh, we're not buying on this one. I never stick my. I never stay around there. All right, it's more pills. So that's good. Could come in handy. Again, we're healing ourselves mostly with our food. Which been really helpful. We had some pills last time. We'll grab a little more view. Excellent. Some dresser. More glasses. Were the glasses better than mine? Nope. Scrap you. That's plus ten. I really don't care for that. Oven. I don't even know why I brought the wrench right now. I just get too exhausted. I can't risk it. Should actually really check this building before. It. Now those cans are worthless to me now because, I, unless I'm stupid and hungry, I get myself killed with that. He made himself across the street. Wow, good job, brother. I'm proud of you. Yeah, Nick could flail, so I should have never walked on top of him until I'm 100 percent sure. Something to get used to. Something to get used to. Now you got some more arrowheads. Jacket. Duct tape. Alright, that's good. Alright, scrap you. $103 jacket. That is pretty damn nice, though, I tell you. It's snazzy. Uh, but yeah, plus 30 insulation. I don't know. Don't think I'm going to need that. Not in this biome. Actually, look at that. I'm 53 Fahrenheit. It actually got cold. It was warm as hell last day. Did hell freeze over? Well, that's something. It's going to be a while before I can do that. Alright, alright. Oh, wow. This is some really nice loot here, too. Just come back for some rock here. Bam. Hit this up all day and all night. Once you start getting better tools, this is going to make a big difference. Oh, my God. Look at that. So much. Can't help myself sometimes. I spend nights literally standing on top of blocks. I just hit it in my... Try and get myself enough rock uh, stones here. See, 139. It's not very much. I think it is, but it isn't. I'm actually clearing up the this for a couple of reasons. Well, A, there's plastics in this one. The only one's material. It also lets in some lights. So I can see what the hell's going on. There's definitely some Zs upstairs. Garen friggin' teed. They're upstairs. Oh, shit. Why is she always in here when I freaking do that I'm bleeding out Whew. all right thank God I made bandages Whew. okay might have stirred up uh, straight up the uh, hornet's nest here Damn, she's good. Look at her roll down the stairs. I think she went underneath the stairs there, or block wise. Damn, he takes a wall. Stamina's gone. Holy moly. Drink some water. There we go. Sometimes I get some stamina back, but uh, also get my health back. That. Oh, that's not good at all. That sound. You know that sounds not good. Up. 
Is this better though? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that cheerleader always comes out and gets me. I don't know what it is. I'm very unlucky with that. Oh my god. Let's get her here. She's... <laughs> Just smacking her, silly. She's stuck inside the foundation here, the actual ceiling. The attic. Oh my god. No, oh, she's down. Oh wow. Oh, Nagur block is gone. Damn it. That's a shame. What? Well, everybody got quiet when they saw me doing that, I guess. I'm sure an exit. Alright, here's the entrance here. Oh my god. There we go. You're down. Your buddies are not down yet. Whew. Hey, you changed. You were... The freak. The punk grew up really quick there. I call foul. There you go, sir. Please give me something decent. Hell, I'll even take your boots. No. Will you give me some... Alright, let's go. Alright, bandages. I can use that. Since I've used one. They thankfully didn't touch what counts. Wow, they were busy in this house. It doesn't take long for them to bust through walls either. Oh, frick, leather. Well, leather. It's okay. Could come in handy. Got to think positive. Positive thoughts, positive thoughts. And a bookcase that's full of stuff. <sighs> Sometimes positive sucks. All right, let's open this up here. And uh, there's no other loot here in the bottom? I don't think so. No. I think we're pretty much done here. Not the greatest of loot, but we did make our way and actually got what we needed. Some stuff. Not so bad. I'm just going to think about what we're going to do next. Next door looks like it's a little more... Hmm, maybe I should look for actual places, places to hit. I got this one already, didn't I? Yes. Yep. Alright, let's take two seconds and think about what we're going to do now. We also have a sleep part over there. Looks a little less ruined. A little more up to date. Maybe we'll hit that up. I'm hitting up all the good trees. Again, we're getting feathers if possible. There we go. And also uh, new seeds so I can plant them next to where we live. So we can do some work at night. Very, very important. The more wood we get, the better off we are. Again, all these things are completely inundated with zombies, so please prepare yourself. You're going to get yourself involved and get in and out of these places. It will be a life-changing event. All right, let's try to scrap you, scrap you. And I don't need a frame, thank you. I don't need that, and I'm definitely not sure about eating this. This is actually what I was talking about last time. Wellness, hydration goes down, but minus 30 effects. Holy crap, man. I don't, I don't think it's worth even keeping this shit anymore. Literally, don't keep that shit. I mean, really, like, livestock is your mainstay. This is your backup in case of emergency. No, well, it's a good change. I mean, I understand, too, the cans, too, themselves uh, can get you sick and stuff uh, from what people are telling me. So, yeah, it is what it is. It's sure freaking quiet. I'm feeling like it's a little too quiet, you know? It's okay. It's good to have sometimes. Mana access goes down so quick. I'm just going to take two seconds to give everybody a chance here. They might spawn in, as you saw before. Get your plastics all you can. Nothing here. That's really strange. Now, do all cans do that? Is every single can? Let's read this. 
Scrap you. Yeah, wellness minus 30. Wow. Really not worth keeping. In case of emergency, I guess it's not so bad at night if you're stuck and you have no food. I guess I can see that. It's unlocked anyways. Uh, we can repair one last time. After that, I will use a new one. So now we're down to 80. It's not a huge difference anyways. Some brass. If we need it. Nothing hidden underneath these plates here because there's nothing here left. I'm just breaking this apart to see if there's anything secret, but I don't think there is. All right, there's a chair there and, of course, a bird's nest, which I missed. We could wrench this up, too, and get some stuff, but we'll, right now we'll just come back afterwards. We have too much to do and very little time to do it. It's going to go quick. All right, these look like a little better houses than these ones. These ones are completely finished. They're finito. Nothing in a trash can. The only thing to survive is the bathroom, sir. I swear to God, I don't know why. It's a good thing, because I was scared shitless. Yep, I can see that happen. Alright, are these houses at all good? I don't think they are. There's something inside here. I'm just going to get this out of my way, too, so I can actually see. break in here and see if we can see what we're going to see. Feral. Feral. Oh, we're in a, you know where. Ouchie. Oh, crap. I thought she got out that door. Big mama feral? She looks like she's feral. It should be a simple moment. Oh shit, I knew she got out. Freak, I gotta hear her running around. Holy moly. Are they multiplying in there or what? Okay, no, it's shoes. Oh, shit. That's it. I had enough of this shit. Holy moly. Am I getting anything from these people? Because this was not worth it. Maybe something inside this damn place. There is pretty much nothing. Damn it. We got a grill. Yeah, we got that. We got at least a bird's nest. Hey. Something. Something for something. Alright, it is what it is. Let's get out of here. I hear crispy clean somewhere here. He's around here somewhere. I like to get rid of him because I can't stand that sound after a while. It freaks me out a tiny bit. He's over here. Oh, he's fighting a ghoul. Oh, that's good. You're just slugging the crap at him, aren't you? Yeah, just give him an upright. Uppercut, uppercut. Oh, uppercut. Holy shit. Did they both die? Or is she's eating them? She's eating them, I think. Oh, Big Mama's going after... Wow, these girls just don't like each other. Not fair, Big Mama. It's not fair. It's not fair. You're much bigger than her, much stronger than her. You can see it, too. Or maybe not. Holy crap, Big Mama. You're just getting a colossal... 
Oh, you see the mar Oh my god, look at the zombies in there. They are so pissed. Alright, she's going in for more on the other side. Most excellent. They really don't like each other. Wow. Oh, shit. Wow, there's a lot of them there, too. I'm happy she's on my side. Oh, let's see a door. That's not fair. That's an ass kicking right there. Trying to break that board block. This dying lands is just a cool ass mod. I love it. It's tough as nails. Gotta be careful. There you go. You can actually use your hands or you can use your shiv. Of course, the shiv is better because of better quality. So you get more bang for your buck. 25 quality in your hands. So that is up to you. All right. Stop switching over to that game edge. Thank you. Grab leather. Grab chairs. Some corn. All right. Zinc. That. Take a plastics out of here. Start wrenching next time. Right now, I don't have time for wrenching whatsoever. Oh, shit. Those cabinet. Damn it. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, thank you. I could really use those today. Big time. I don't think there's anything else here. It just goes right up to the ceiling. There's nothing else. Yeah, the other one's 1,200 on top. Excellent. Mailbox. Some paper. A little bit of a tree over here. Wow. That was pretty intense just for a small amount. They saw a ghoul, the way they reacted. It's pretty kind of amazing. Timmy did a great job. I like that a lot. That sand and stuff. All right, what do we have here? Potatoes. Excellent. Take you all. Box, more sandbags. All right, what do we have over here? More houses and stuff. This is like, this town is like becoming now really desolate on this side. As you can see. Last time I found that that biome in the last, I think I was just lucky as hell. I'm not seeing any golden rod or anything here at all. Oh, there's some golden rod down here. Okay, that's what I was looking for. Whew, that's going to help me with our wellness and many other things. Get them nice and quenched them up. How are you doing, sir? We got 176 arrows. You think I get you off that? I think I can work. Okay. I could cl uh, I could club you, but you're, you're on fire. Kind of dangerous. Not in the mood. You mind uh, gore blocking just a little bit? Just bloop. Thank you. Appreciate that. Get some more arrowheads. Very, very cool. All right. Strange when this actually ends up being the big thing to go and get. Eh? Now, here's actually a good way to hit this up early in the game, too. You can hit this part up. It's a fast rock. I love it. Really fast way to get it. And we'll get this. Oh, so nice. So nice. I'm so happy we just found some. This is actually a pretty decent place. We could probably build our place here, too. Our base is pretty far away from the town, but it's good enough to see. It's flat as heck. It is nice to see some real flat areas, too. I'm not going to bother with the rocks right away as much as I'm going to be just picking up every bit of goldenrod tea to make. I'm built to make goldenrod with this very, very simplistically. At least we have everything we need to do it. So I'm going to pick you up, pick this up. Man. Whew. And also cotton. Wicked. I'm not seeing very many birds in this run area, but I guess they're more in the trees now. I mean, 
the trees themselves. Well, that's interesting. The frick is that? That's so cool. Holy shit, it's not cool, it's not cool, it's not cool. Oh man, I thank God for my ghoul friends. Holy shit, they're colossal hits. That's not very nice of you. There you go. In your head. No, 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 no. You're supposed to help me out. Yeah, that's it. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. Break him in half. There's a freaking chicken over there. Nice to keep my stamina up. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Shit. I gotta aim a little lower, I think. This just makes it a lot easier. I seem to get the headshots there, anyways. Okay. Core block on my shoulders. Here you go. Now you're going. To... There we go. Let me check what's inside there. I mean, I think they dug their way through that actual rock, but it would look really cool. I thought it was an entrance to a cave. I was like, oh, this is awesome. And it wasn't, as you saw. It looked cool, though. I think they just made their way around here. They just dug their way through, and that's where we ended up. It's very cool. I don't remember seeing a pile like this, though. This is very different. Definitely something I've not seen before. Uh, not this stuff. I've seen with like in with like little iron and stuff and other mods, but not with this. This is kind of very, very cool. See more goldenrod and stuff. Pick that up right away. That is so amazing right now. I'm seeing a big ass town on the other side. Let's just double check that, okay? We're just gonna double check that. We're gonna. Oh, I thought it was a purse. We're just gonna double check to see if that is true. That is. Then it's actually in a better biome. And also, the if you're looking for snow and you're not saying, God, it's not not very much snow. There isn't. It's in the hills. You have to go inside the. You have to go on top of the mountain and go and pick that up. So colder parts it makes sense. Very intelligent to add that onto the to, to the actual uh, mod too. I like that. It doesn't look like it's a big town. I think it's just uh, a couple of buildings over there. Strewn in. There is a road that comes up to here, and then ends over there and goes back over there. Okay. Hmm. All right. Well, we have to make our way back. I'm gonna pick up as much of the golden rod unless something happens. Well, once something happens, I'll, I'll come right back. But for now, I'm just gonna pick up all this junk and then we'll head back into town. Won't be long. All right, so we're back, and we got actually some uh, skills points that kept on going up there. I didn't really check on them. So we have weapon skills. We have 26 points to spend. Let's get that up. Uh, we're going to get some tool smithing done. Uh, mine tools and all that. Okay, by mechanic. We'll deal with that in just a bit. I uh, do want to see if there is a, a little bit more sexual transaurus. Stamina gain. Much needed. Of course, uh, blade weapons and other things. I'd like to get to see more knife guy, more pump. Pete, I'll have to start using them more to get that going. Uh, we're also going to make ourselves a bench and stuff, so that's going to be Construction Tools Workbench itself. It'll be the next one here, which will unlock with Toolsmithing 2. Uh, right here, okay, we got that. And that's all we're missing was what? Points, right? 10 points. All right, cool. So we'll get that done. We're actually going to get rid of you. Scrap you, scrap you, and drop you. We'll start off with the shiv itself. Actually, I should always make sure I have a weapon before I start doing anything. Oh, my God. What if somebody came in from nowhere and attacked us right now? That could happen. Club, it could be a horde man. I don't know. It could happen. A uh, bow here. Let's do that. And we'll move some of these stuff in place here. We did pretty good. We actually got quite a bit about 49. 49 plants. Not horrible. Blueberry pie here. I'm going to eat that. Thankfully, it does not going to be sick in any way, shape, or form. I don't like the way I'm looking right now. It doesn't look good at all. And uh, I'm not going to eat that. We'll eat the rest of this. While this is still crafting up, this is going to go here. Actually, I'll move this rifle here. It comes very close a couple times where I'm going to shoot that. Uh, but then again, damn it. Uh, clubs right over here. There you go. Put the rifle at the end. 
just for security purposes because I shot them by mistake. I'd hate to do it over and over again. Uh, this is going to go here. We just need a shiv here. Where's the bones I picked up? Let's do recipes. Bone shiv. Craft. Bam. There we go. We're good to go. Better quality tools make everything just a little bit better. <laughs> All right, that's cool. Yeah, I was just hitting this up and I was trying to get most of it done and completed. Uh, again, we ate a little bit. We can drink a little bit more. Hopefully, we'll find some more water and we'll fill up the vials. We do have already murky water here and we have 13 right now to fill up. Uh, 14. There we go. Boom. And uh, we're not going to eat these things. I don't want to get sick. Not in the mood. All right, let's get ourselves going here all the way back home. I am uh, not anywhere close from home, really. Not too far away, but not like super close. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys where we're at for that. That's for sure. Again, rocks and stuff. Everything is very important at this current stage of our game. But these golden rod teas, I'm so happy to find us. We'll come back and get more of these as we go. Uh, but for now, we're going to have to just pick up whatever we can on our way back home. Whew. Man, I also found a shite load, shite load of bird's nests, which is nice. Hey, helps for scavenging. Plus, hey, we can use them the way we're actually spending the arrows right now. How many arrows do I have anyways? 137. That is okay. What if a horde came in? Then there would be a whole bunch of problems. So let's do arrows here. And we're going to do, I don't know, 63. Let's do, let's keep it there. Yeah, let's keep it around 63. Keep it as nice and high. And I still have 67 arrows left. This is going to bring up to 200. Make me happy. Whew, man. It's, it's, uh, it's non-stop. It's non-stop. Talking about that, let's make sure our bow is ready to go. Bam. Now she's good. Now she's good. I figured a horde would have come in by now, at least a watering one. Uh, but it is only day two, and I think we've uh, got a lot more expected. I mean, it's hard to find things, so... But uh, I do think the balance he's done, Tin, has been working out pretty good on the actual amount of uh, ghouls and zombies. Gives us a chance to do stuff. I don't want it to be a mod where I'm ball, you know, busting my balls like uh, CB mod, which just you know takes away from the fun. This is more uh, durable. I can do it. Maybe just a you know, little crack here. I'm probably going to lift up the levels a little higher. And the amount I can actually have of Z's that I come in at the same time too for Blood Moon. If it's like this, this is just absolutely fine for me. This is very cool. All right, we should be almost back. We should be able to see some buildings and stuff. And then loot maybe one or two more. <sighs> maybe I should just drop this shit off and harvest as much as I can for tonight. Oh, there's so much to do. Shite. And a garbage can. So... Well, garbage everywhere too and with the plant as much as we can what i'm trying to do the most is actually hit up these wonderful trees and that's the reason why oh, i hear something there she is she's trying to sneak up on me do you see that look at that There's snakes out here too Keep her alive for a bit longer. Can't see that snake. Can she attack the snake for me? It'd be too kind of you, wouldn't it? Huh? I should have to drag you over there, but I just don't know where the freaking snake is. I love how she lunges at us, though. Enough of this. Here comes the snake. Yeah, he's really wanting me big time. He's not happy with something. There we go. Beautiful. Whew. Yeah, like I was saying, yeah, let's uh I did get a tree up, perfect. Uh, I have six C's now. I'm trying to make sure I can put them down in the right place. Plus, like I mentioned, feathers, feathers, feathers in there. Plus the bushes. So very, very much important. How much rocks do we have now? 180. Still struggling with that. And that's pretty much what I'm going to have to do all day for the rest of the day. It's find some rock and stuff. So I'm not going to bore you guys with this, but it's been quite interesting. Tomorrow I'll be a little more looting inside the houses and investigating maybe the north side of it. Or northwest, I guess, to see where we're at. I think that's where we have to go next. Done a pretty good check of this area. Probably, actually, I'm probably going to go west and check out a little more on that side just to double check it. 
it sounds like a plan. But thank you guys so much for being here. I do appreciate it. Again, if you guys like this series, you want to see a whole lot more of it, make sure you hit that like button. This is the Edge Image. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.